Okay, today I want to show you how I prep my meal and you need to prepare a zipper locks, what I show you right now, and uh, leg quarters. Normally leg quarters I buy from Aldi, it's more cheaper price than it's Walmart in different way, but you can buy leg quarters anywhere. They, uh, from Aldi it's around $5 and Walmart it's around 6 and more dollars in different store. I normally prepare a little bit zipper locks um, and done them before that because my hands will be dirty and uh, prepare a uh, perfect knife for cutting kind of bone and meat um, it's hard to cut fat or skin for me but uh, normally leg quarters if it's full leg quarters I cut them in three pieces and you can see I cut all leg quarters in three pieces will be included bones, what I want for my, for my dog. He needed to eat bones and um, both of my dogs. Again, I have chihuahua, I have a two dogs, one chihuahua and one is a Maltese and um, this is meal I prepare. Normally it's going to be one leg quarters for one dog and one for another one. But sometimes they come up um, drumstick there or maybe ties only and um, it's kind of like no good quality meat but I'm okay with that they don't normally eat normally like only chicken like today there was half I have unfroze for us organic ground beef I give them ground beef and chicken too uh, or sometimes they have fish. If I eat fish, I normally love them for, for fish and cut on a pieces and give them fish. Or sometimes I give them eggs. I always try to incorporate different type of food for them. Another thing, I give them vegetables. Uh, my older dog do not like so much vegetables, but my younger dog, Malti, she loved vegetables and her favorite is cauliflower and broccoli. She not favor on um, carrots and different stuff, but normally she love that. Uh, over time, you will when you start cut uh, prepare meat for your dogs, you will know where to cut and how to broke on a pieces. Normally, you cannot cut a bone, but you can cut through this. Talking about like you normally need broken up through joints, and uh, how you will be cut meat. I will, if you see I separated buy packages how much going on a package and um, it's going to be second one right now will be separated and it's per day normally i rarely uh, happen it is going to another day but it's normally per day if i give them this whole package going for one day but if i have extra like i tell about today ground beef they don't get this whole package it's too much food for them they want it's uh, 13 pounds and a smaller dog i have five pounds dog they do not need to eat too much stuff and normally they don't eat so much stuff if i give too much uh, they let go you see where i show right now um i broken bones through joints how they is easy to cut and normally you kind of know like you see if it's it's broken up you will fill and you can go through knife easily it's normally like chicken ties ch drumstick included and uh, around chicken tie they have like bo um, bone it's almost like a lot of bone inside there and again I show this stuff and how I cut. Um, I will uh, right now speed up I think video and I will go through um, whole video and I will come back to talk about more but what I do normally if you see it's already have for free bags for zipper bags three days of meal and it's so easy package again cost around five dollars the cheaper way it's an Aldi in our area a new area can be cast one dollar up and down and um and walmart is a little bit more expensive but aldi is best price for me but aldi sometimes doesn't have this meat i think people like sometimes if they save money they buy for themselves uh, and yeah this is meat 
how I prepare meat for my dogs. One bag, what I tell you $5 cost, it's normally come for, uh, for five or six days, I will say. And a, it's enough for a whole week to prepare food and be ready to put in a refrigerator and unfroze. In the morning, I take it out bag, one bag from the freezer and unfroze the bag and later I give them it's pretty cold and we live in texas it's really hot if you see in the freezer i have specific um, place for dog food um, i label some dog food but you see in the green but normally it's in a zipper log i unfroze them in the morning and the later i separate by i have two dogs separate them and give them specific food Again, I incorporate uh, vegetables and um, and a different type of food, but this is what normally I have. Right now I have uh, eight packs for eight days. Uh, I prepare for a little bit more and done. i show you right now a short clip my Maltese eating raw food. I know it's a little bit disgusting. Uh, her face little bit always dirty, but um, I try to wash her bathing uh, every other day and wash her face. And uh, yes, but it's healthy, I believe. And uh, this is how she eat her raw food. You can enjoy.